Welcome back! The evening was upon us as we departed Anacortes, so we made our way over quickly to duck into a nice anchorage for the night. This time, we attached to a very seaweed-filled mooring ball to give that another practice try instead of using our ground tackle. Which was very nerve-wracking considering just how windy it was. This was Cyprus Island, our home for the evening and the historical home to the Coast Salish people. Named mistakenly for what Europeans thought were cypress trees, which instead were actually juniper. Today it is mostly underdeveloped, home to approximately 6,000 acres of protected ecosystems. And it has two free mooring balls for public use. This part of the island is known as Cypress Head. We were all ready to relax, but my poor Lori had to make dinner. Thank you for cooking, baby. We were super lucky to have Lori cooking for us. And before you knew it, it was gone. Mabel was upset not getting her taste. Okay. Grab the ladder okay. and just use the boat and spin your boat. Yeah, there you go. This isn't going to help you. Yeah, what you're doing. So just keep spinning the boat because I need Can I to... spin that way? Yeah, because I want the transom below to... this engine. So come back here now. Come back to the back of the boat. Our boat has a magical davit that lets Lori single-handedly lift and lower the outboard engine that weighs almost a hundred pounds. We were having difficulty starting the outboard once it was in place. But it made like an extra little that time. <laughs> you're, you're, you're tripping. You're tripping, man. I do think I might have flooded it though. Uh, okay. Yeah, so this is your vent. If you don't have this open and you're running the engine, this will suck, uh, run out of air. Oh. And then it runs out of fuel. So you'll open this, you'll hear, and then you can reprime this whole line again. So right now, this is nice and stiff. Right. right. Have so to do we it have over fuel. Again. Yeah. Yeah, I smell gas, so I flooded it. Okay. Best thing I could do is wait five minutes and then maybe it'll start. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. I don't mind waiting. Nice to keep a positive yeah. attitude. Off camera, we were actually able to finally start it after it rested. The next morning, we set out to return to Bellingham. This was our last day of training. What an insightful few days we experienced. We learned a lot and still needed to learn loads more. Still, we were excited for all the firsts already accomplished. Little did we know the impending blow waiting for us back at the dock. So, here we are. I bet you're wondering, where the heck is this? Remember that impending blow? Well, turns out my bad steering wasn't solely my fault. 
Just before trying to return to our old slip, Bear had a small encounter with the dock. Unfortunately, what none of us realized at the time was we had a leak happening in our hydraulic steering, leading Aliath to becoming completely immobile. So, this is the Entai at the entrance to Squalicum Harbor at the port of Bellingham, where we ended up. For now. Now it was on us to get this steering repaired, so we could get back out there and add upon what we've learned. Until then, wish us luck. We're going to need it. Hello, fellow humans. And a sincere thank you to all of you for watching this far. Whether you've been with us since season one or you're just joining in for season two, we really appreciate all of you and especially the ones that we've met out there. So thank you for watching. Yeah, and we just wanted to update y'all on a new way to support our channel. It's called Coffee. Spelled K-O-F-I. So if you're able and willing and have a desire to help us out, you can find the link down below. Yeah, and it can be one-time donation or multiple. And all coffee supporters will gain access to our private Discord channel just for you guys and us. And some extra behind-the-scenes footage. This week, we're going to tell you about the captain we almost hired. Spilled the tea. And regardless of if you can contribute, we look forward to sharing the rest of our journey with you. Thanks for watching. See you out there. Hit that like button if you enjoyed. And please consider subscribing if you don't already. Thanks for watching.